Right behind me is the aftermath of an early morning fire. Fire crews have been out here mopping up for hours. All that's left of this warehouse is rubble. All I saw was the smoke in the air, you know, maybe 20, 30 feet in the air. Just before three in the morning, this fire on Stockton's main street produced a tower of smoke. The blaze giving fire crews a fierce fight. Crews arrived and they found debris in the front of this building that was on fire. Uh, and it was quickly moving, ended up catching the building on fire. Stockton Fire Department's Brandon Doolin says it took all of the city of Stockton's fire department resources to put this out. We ended up raising this to five alarms. Doolin says no one was hurt, but the inferno threatened this church and a school. We were able to get enough resources in place with enough water flowing to kind of push back the radiant heat and, and get the buildings cool. Cool enough to spare those buildings of the fiery wrath, but not all structures nearby were unscathed. A series of a couple of buildings with a, a share a center wall. Um, so with all the roof gone, there's no stable stability to these masonry walls. They're bowed and could drop at any minute. And this warehouse is now reduced to pieces. This single pallet is all that remains of what was outside. For total loss. Nearby business owner John Anderson says it could take six to eight months to rebuild. He will have to upgrade with fire hydrants, fire sprinklers. I'm sure that he's going to build back the property and probably bigger and better. And this fire is still under investigation. In Stockton, covering local news that matters, Krista Marton, Fox 40 News.